All right, guys, I'm currently in Nevada. It's actually really, really interesting here. Uh, it's still pretty chilly outside and you can still see snow on top of the mountains, but it's really, really cool. I really, you know, like this time of season here. Uh, it's not too hot, not too cold. It's actually perfect and <laughs> just the way I like it. Hey guys, welcome back to Vito's Garage. Thanks so much for watching and tuning in. Before we start this video, I just wanted to talk to you about this uh, really cool YouTube channel. It's called Honda Yamaha Fan and uh really really like this channel and just wanted to um, you know recommend for you guys to go uh, to that channel and actually subscribe and watch their videos it's actually really really cool uh two guys their names are blake and andrew they're really really cool they're doing a bunch of uh, interesting videos uh, related to cars uh, mopeds and what have you it's really really cool stuff and it's not just it's actually a variety of everything uh there's actually in their videos they have classic mercedes they have classic uh, American cars and a bunch of other interesting stuff so I really really recommend for you guys to go and check out their channel uh, if you guys would like to please go up here in the in this link uh, and subscribe to the channel uh, and also just so you know Andrew he also loves uh, classic uh, Mercedes a lot and he actually reached out to me and he showed me that uh, he has uh, you know, a couple of classic Mercedes. Uh, one of them is a W126, which is a really cool car. And he's been, you know, taking care of that car. And he also loves saving those cars. So please uh, go to their, their channel and support those guys. Actually really fun. Just fun watching watching them rebuilding some stuff and ma or making things uh, better on, you know, whether it's a vehicle or something else that they're working on, their projects and what have you. But yeah, um please go ahead and look up their channel uh, it's gonna be also down in the description box so thanks so much you guys and let's get started before we start this video thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe to my channel it's gonna be a lot of interesting videos coming up and today we're actually gonna go and check out uh, a really interesting junkyard and you know i'm gonna tell you one thing that i'm not a fan of going to the junkers because i always get really really sad when i go there um and depressed <laughs> yeah believe it or not because you know i hate seeing all these amazing old school cars just junked like that so uh yeah but i just wanted to take you guys along and just show you um a couple of reasons why i love these particular junkyards and if you're the owner of the junkyard like this you know props to you thank you so much and keep it up because we need all of those parts saved up So what I love about these uh, specific junkyards is that they actually pull the engines and transmissions out of basically almost every car and they save those. That's what's really awesome about this place is that's uh, what they're doing. There's a bunch of different cars here, but yeah, all the engines and transmissions are basically out and they save them up. They sell them separately, which is really, really good. You know, I love these types of junkyards because they save all these parts and that's really really good <clears throat> i'm usually sad coming to this place or just any type of junkyard i know a lot of people usually get excited but i'm not especially when i see all these legendary cars just scrapped and uh, this is x5 looks like e70 oh man look at that letter you clean that thing it's gonna be like new man yeah, and actually the manager told me that, uh, you know, the mechanics that actually take out the engines and transmissions, you know, they're actually being really careful with like the interior and all that so they can save all these parts and, you know, because sometimes people also want interior parts, you know. All right, I'm interested in Beamers and Benzes. Obviously, if we see any other Euro cars, I'm gonna film that, but this is a S210. The engine is also out on it. And the trans. Man. An amazing machine. Legendary car. Ooh. Yeah, look at that tailgate. Is also somebody bought it probably, or sometimes actually when they take out the, um, um, you know, all the body parts, sometimes they actually put them in the, uh, in the uh, building right there. 
and then also take a look at this when they pull the engines and transmissions out they actually save all these parts as well which is so cool like starters power steering pumps and all that take a look at this the somebody even took out the rear subframe on this s210 and it's crazy everything's still there all the nitrogen spheres oh my god it's crazy Oh, I want to go over there, look at those cars, see some old school Mazdas, Hondas and all that. Yeah, a lot of legendary cars here for sure. That is for sure. Mini is here too. Damn, super sad seeing all these cars here, honestly. That's why when I come to the junkyard, I I just hate coming to the junkyard, honestly. So I just, um, I get sad. Just way too many of them, honestly. Oh boy. Even uh, newer Chevy Cruises already in the junkyard. Wow. And what do we see? Legendary E39. Amazing machine. Oh, legendary car. Man, I just love the quality of these cars. Yeah, that <clears throat> old school, late 90s smell, that's so amazing. Oh, yeah. It's crazy, even floor mats are there. Oh my God. Amazing car. And I really just saw something from far away. We're gonna go check out that car. Looks like a W124 to me. Oh my God. All right, Andrew, if you're watching this uh, uh, video, thank you so much for actually uh, supporting me and actually sending me some funds, which are gonna go to saving these amazing old school uh, European cars. So thank you so much for that. And thank you for all the other patrons who actually contributed and uh, donated some money. Thank you guys, I really love you. Um, and thank you for loving and caring about these old school amazing cars because they don't make them like they used to. So, so thank you so much guys and if you guys want to if you are able to uh donate to the channel the links are going to be down below thank you so much for everything and just so you remember all the funds that are going uh into the channel are actually going to go towards saving amazing old school cars so thanks so much for that this is crazy and a 126 too man that's so sad Look at these cars. What the hell? What in the actual hell? Dude, look at the interior of this one. It's not that bad. Oh my God. This is crazy. Dude. That's crazy, dude. This is a diesel. I'm pretty sure it's a diesel. That is a diesel. It's a vacuum uh, transducer under the hood. Dude. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I can't damn believe it. My tools. Oh man. Dude, that's not bad at all. Dude, that's crazy. That is insane. Oh boy. Oh no. Legendary machine. Oh, I did not realize that that's a 300 SD. Man, what is wrong with people? 
Why would you be cutting this thing if your trunk lock is stuck? You freaking stupid. Are you kidding me? Dude, are you mentally ill to do this? Are you kidding me? Holy crap. That is crazy. Man, what an amazing car. 152,000 miles. That's sad. That is super sad. I don't know if the engine, I'm assuming the engine is out. Oh, that's a Texas car. I feel like Texas people are crazy. Let's see if I can open this. Ta-da! They did take this, this engine out, huh? Very interesting. Everything's still here. Oh my god. Roosters everywhere? Yeah. All these legendary cars. X5 E53. Lovely machine. Lovely machine, man. I'm gonna have one of these at some point for sure. Oh, dude. I love E53s. And the Civic is actually a really cool color. Really dig these colors. Pretty sure it's a factory color. Everything is torn apart. Two door. Dang. So what a shame, dude. Why can't there be good people saving these cars? I don't understand. What I'm about to show you, you're gonna lose your mind. What I'm about to show you. Just wait. It's even Mustangs are here. A bunch of newer Mustangs. All right. This is so sad. Take a look at this wagon. S124 Mercedes wagon. This thing is like brand new, literally. Uh, this is crazy, guys. Everything is already out of it, basically. But take a look how clean this thing is, dude. What a shame, dude. What a damn shame. Sad baby. Oh man. Literally, everything is like new on it. Wow. Can't believe it, dude. Can't believe it. This is so sad. This is depressing.